Hi, welcome to Green Drake Outfitters. Today we'll be tying the mohair leech. First we'll be using a streamer style hook and 6 aught thread. Tie on your thread near the base. Tie all the way back before the bend of the hook. Trim off your waist. Next, tie in a marabou tail about the length of your shank. I like to tie it in at the base, work my way up. Then I like to cut it off about the entire length of the shank that I get so I can get a bigger body. So make sure you wind it all down onto the shank of the hook. Next we're going to add a little bit of crystal flash into the tail. This just adds a little something for the fish to notice your fly. <coughs> Tie it on each side of your tail and if you need to, trim off any excess. Next you'll be tying in your mohair leech yarn. Uh, it's either called just mohair yarn or leech yarn. Then you're going to wrap it up in nice tight wraps close to each other and pull back the fibers so they don't get caught underneath the yarn. And this will help it give a nice furry fluffy body. And if you wanted to, you could add a rib if you feel the need to have the yarn to be more secure in. You would tie it in before the yarn, then tie it off after you finished wrapping in your yarn. You could also add in a bead at the top of the hook before you make any wraps, or even place it into your vise. And you could also add lead wire underneath the yarn. That's if you wanted to add weight to your fly. Now cut off the tag end of your yarn. Create a small tapered head. Then whip finish. After you're done on those steps, take a dubbing brush and brush out those hairs. Make sure you get them all out. Gives you a nice fuller body. <clears throat> then after that, you have a mohair leech. <laughs> 